Hey, I'm Zappa. And I'm Zero. And today we're reviewing Attack of the Cherry Stout. It's a new cherry stout by Parkside Brewing. It seems fun to say it that way. Attack. Yeah, well, I, apparently it's going to attack our taste buds with flavor. <laughs> Alright. <Wait. laughs> Disturbingly dark, I like. I like the whole cartoon thing on the can. Yeah, it's cool. cool. See how it goes. Oh yeah, there's a the stout. Got definitely a stout. Mm. Mild cherry. Mild, yep. I like it. Actually, I like the cherry flavor in it. It's yeah, nice. it's it's very subtle in there, but you can yeah. feel it. Taste it. I I I I like this more than a lot of other stouts I've had. But it's still I'm it's stout. very yeah. it's still very much a stout. It's good. It kind of tastes like uh one of those cherries that you get around Christmas time that are like gooey cherries and then chalk. Covered in chocolate? Yeah, like <sighs> I don't know what they're called. Yeah, yeah. But like everyone's mom eats them. Yeah. <laughs> everyone's mom. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like it's a very mom thing to eat those cherries. Your mom, them. yes. Yeah, mom definitely eats them. <laughs> but <laughs> that's what it tastes like to me. Like the aftertaste, it feels like it just had one of those. And I love yeah, that. Actually, yes, I yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Sort of like a bitterness. Actually now bitterness. that you put it like that too, it actually the aftertaste is that, that, for sure. Which is delightful. Yeah. Yeah, I quite enjoy that. Yeah, the first, and for me, the first sip, don't like, like because it just, it's that stout. Coffee. Yeah. yeah. You get coffee right in that. But then, the like now, as it's settling in, yeah. I actually do like it. So what would you, uh, what would you rate this one? Um, it's tough. Because uh, stouts aren't, you know, aren't on my top of my list of favorite. Styles of beer, right. uh, but you do tend to like. I do like stouts generally. Um, I think this is very good stout, very top. I really like the cherry flavor. I like the aftertaste. It's nice and smooth. Um, sort of has everything I'm looking for in a stout, and it has a nice little bonus of the cherry. Right. Um, so I'm gonna give it a seven. Seven. Uh, I think that's fair. I think most stouts I would give a About six. That, yeah. um, Generally, as if it's like as a stout, you're giving it that level. So you're giving yes. a high, high number for a stout. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Because I don't think a stout would ever be for me a, a nine or a ten. ten. Yeah. See, I, I, I kind of, I have the same kind of thinking. I can, I can taste that this is a good beer. Yeah. But not being a stout fan, I can't go very high. Um, so I, I, I think I'd give it a five. Right. Which. In the same kind yeah. of story as you, that's a high number. That is a high stout. Because I actually, like I say, that aftertaste, I'm loving. Yeah. Just that initial taste thing. It makes me want a chocolate cherry thing. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever they're called. <laughs> makes me want one. Shout out to Travis uh, and the Parkside team for the continuous support. It's really awesome. Thank yeah. you guys. Cheers. Cheers. It. Thanks. Cheers. That's all we have for this time. If you like what you watch, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Cheers. Cheers.